the 20th anniversary, I'm, I'm incredibly excited to be up there. I think it's really a testament to the space station uh, that we've built. And this has been uh, humans, engineers, and scientists from all countries uh, around the world have been part of this. It's just an incredible engineering and a scientific marvel. I'm just contemplating how we built this million pound structure while flying around the earth at uh, 17,500 miles an hour in a vacuum and extremes of temperatures of plus or minus 270 degrees. Built by an international partnership, 15 different countries, languages, different cultures, different technical ways of doing things. This space station, this is the hardest thing we've ever done. When we're working in space, there is no such thing as politics. We are all in the same boat. Everyone understands that, both astronauts and cosmonauts. And we remain friends to this day. We didn't have disagreements then and we don't have them now. That's an example that needs to be recreated back here on Earth. And I'm still surprised as to why the participating countries don't understand this. The, the ISS program is a prime example of what people and countries can do when they have a common goal. Uh, I always say that there are two ways to unify people. The, the populist approach is to find an enemy and to, and to try to create, an, to create an enemy or find it to galvanize people against that enemy. But there is also a, a positive approach, which is to have a common goal, a common dream. You know, I think one of the most uh, significant uh, accomplishments of the International Space Station is that it was an international program and it was an ex and it's a continuing experiment of how you can get people to live and work in, in uh, a confined uh, space uh, in space in uh, you know a very dangerous risky environment because someday we want to go to Mars we want to go to other places in our solar system we have to understand how uh, to support the crew physically from, you know, providing them oxygen, scrubbing the atmosphere of carbon dioxide, provide for their physical health, provide for their mental health as well. Um, so I think the success of the space station was, is the fact that, you know, we've done that for, for 20 years.